Everyone, this is Andrew Gann with Work-Life Enrichment Seminar. And today, I have a special announcement. Okay? A lot of you are trapped in your house right now. Yes, exactly. COVID-19 has had everyone either trapped in their house or what do we call it? Social distancing, right? But what I want to do today, I want to take some time to give you about a three to five minute program that you can do anywhere inside your house. You can turn your house into a gem, all right? So that's what we're going to work on today. I'm excited if you're excited, so let's get ready. Let's do this. Today we're talking about wellness, complete wellness. Now, for 2019, you may have spent most of your time working as an entrepreneur. The purpose of this video is to encourage those who are entrepreneurs, especially those who are always on the go. I started a podcast that says this is your day. Day. Day means decide, say yes to yourself, right? Day. Decide, take action, and say yes to yourself. So I'm going to take you on a run this morning because this is what I normally do as part of my routine. And we're talking about wellness and how entrepreneurs can transform their life by making sure that they're doing the things that are most important in their life to not only move their business forward, but to keep them alive so they can sustain longevity over time. There are millionaires, billionaires who have started business many, many years ago. And you know what? It's strange that someone else had to come and take it over. Why? Because they weren't living long enough. They weren't healthy enough to carry on the vision and to complete the mission of what they were doing. So this one just want to take you on a job with me. Wellness is important. It's important because it's the engine that helps you. This set of exercises for people who are more advanced in their fitness level. So we want you to take care. All right, so first thing we're going to start off just to get the heart rate up. We're just going to have some running on the spot. You could be doing this in your basement, in your living room, on your carpet. Doesn't matter. Just want to get that heart rate up. And that's exactly what we're doing right here. After that, followed by what's called high knees. That's when your palms are down, you lift your knees up to your hand as high as possible followed by what's called jumping jacks. You want to make sure that you cross your hand over your head as you do this jumping jacks while bending your knees slightly. We're going to keep doing that and follow through with jumping ropes. So we're going to go through jumping ropes. If you don't have jumping rope, then you just put your hand at your side and pretend as if you have a rope, but keep doing the jumping motion and keep going forward. Next thing we're going to do after we finish the jumping rope, we're going to start by getting you warmed up a little bit more by running. You could be doing laps back and forth in your backyard. You could be doing this at the front of your house on the driveway. You just wanna make sure you get that cardio and that's exactly what we're gonna do before we get into more strenuous activity. Always wanna make sure we warm up as much as we can. The next thing we're gonna do after we finish with our warm up, then we're gonna get some strength training so we can really address and challenge those muscles. So what we're doing right now is a lateral push up and moving across. We're pushing up and we're moving laterally. You can do this in your basement, across your living room, on the carpet, doesn't matter, as long as you have some space to move. The next thing we're doing is called mountain climbing. These are crisscross mountain climbing on the inside. And next we're gonna move into what's called the Spider-Man. Spider-Man is when you're still doing the mountain climbing, you're doing them on the outside, okay? The next exercise we're gonna go into is called flutter kicks. Flutter kicks is when you're moving your feet like in a scissor-like fashion. Now we're doing what's called knee crunches, pulling your knee towards your chest as high and as hard and squeezing your abdominal muscles as you pull in. This exercise is difficult. So we're doing what's called thrust and we're pushing and pulling and pushing and pulling that means we're pulling our abs in and pushing our heels up into the air these are called box jumps we're jumping over what's called a box jump back and forth skipping back and forth this is cardio exercise great for the legs this is what's called a box jump the first one was crossover this is what the box jump this is more advanced so if you're not um, up to par in terms of your skill level you will make sure you get some supervision or don't do this exercise at all you can just jump on your stairs
Andrew the Ice Geek Empowering you to create your greatest impact where you live, where you work, where you play. All right. So, 